Hello and welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. So, we need to go and steal Shido's heart, but that's in 22 days. However, I have been told that his palace works similar to how some other palaces worked in the past, where we can do the first part and then send the calling card on the last possible day. So, this means that effectively what we should do is wait till we have an empty day, if we think we've got all the mementos things, go to mementos. Otherwise, go to his palace. That's what I think we should do. Also, I noticed this. So the heater. It's nice and warm. There still seems to be enough fuel left. This implies to me that we may run into a situation where we need to refuel it for some reason. I don't know what reason that would be. I don't know where we'd get the fuel, but the fact it says that it still has fuel left implies something. Also, hello Morgana. Okay. It's still early days here. Let's take it nice and easy for now. I haven't decided yet. That's fine, let's head downstairs. What are you doing here? Don't you know that I'm a violent criminal with nothing to lose? You're risking your life just entering this building. A horrific drama is unfolding before me. I never expected such a frightening uproar. Hmm. You mean the elections? I don't care about that rigged race, I'm talking about my blog being attacked. Hmm, all I did was praise my fi- All I did was praise my film critiques under another name. Just a little bit of acting. Somehow the internet found out and hates me now. The jeers get worse when I explain myself. Perhaps this is a sign. Perhaps I'll move on from critiquing films to the next stage of my career. Well, I'll be going home then. Yep. Yep, you better go home. A fierce battle begins as the date of the House of Representatives election is announced. The United Future, a new party led by Masayoshi Shido, is, garner is garnering a great deal of support. They have been winning the hearts of voters with powerful speeches and easily understood rhetoric. Now, where have I heard that before? Hmm, just you watch. We'll have you in tears before long. Just don't do anything rash, not like you listen to me anyway. Alright Shido, we'll see you later. So, Futaba, we've got an up but it's locked by Mementos. Ryuji is an up to a 10. Haru is an up. I'm gonna go see Ryuji. I wanna do his one. So he's at the, um, he's at the arcade, but I just remembered somewhere else we can go. We've got a new daily thing. Also the, ca the controls got super messed up when I turned around without changing the camera. Hello. Oh, it's lottery ticket day. Congratulations, 10,000 yen. Oh, yeah. All right. Hello. I would Welcome. love to buy a lottery ticket. It's my favorite thing in the world. Uh, 12-3. Okay, that's really soon. That's like just one week away. Okay, interesting. Uh, sometimes it's like really long, far away. There must be another lottery before the... Um, yeah, there must be another lottery before the thing then. Or that goes after it. Uh, yeah, he's max rank, so I don't care about having the right persona. Hello. I'm gonna make him pay. Goddamn Shido. We seriously gotta change his heart fast. Anyways, what's the plan? Let's hang out. We can head to the metaverse by going to him. Interesting. You think? Dude, seriously. Don't we gotta hurry on this shit? We have plenty of time. <sighs> oh, you never change. Well, I'm down for it if you are. Just make sure you don't let anyone see you, yeah? You feeling up for a little exercise? You are, aren't you? Come on, let's go. I got something I want to talk to you about, Durin. Yeah, let's go. Nobody thinks you're alive at this point, so it should be okay as long as you're careful. So what do you plan on doing? You want to hang out with Ryuji? I wonder if Ryuji's would be locked at this point if you... I guess not, because the school people just think you're away. But I was going to say, like, if you still had those events left in school. But, yeah, it probably is locked. But maybe it's not. I don't know. Maybe it just doesn't worry about it. Want to get going? Oh, yeah, let's grab some ramen after we finish training, then. I'm ready. Ah, uh, this is a perfect way to refill after some training. By the way, the track team's up and running again. Yamauchi got taken down pretty quick. You know Takeishi's mom is the PTA press, right? He told her everything. After
after that, she came storming in with the other parents and forbid the whole scouting plan. Oh, wish I could have seen the look on Yamauchi's face. <laughs> I mean, the school can't ignore the PTA. Well, especially with the bad press they've already got. And as a result, the track team's back. Our old coach is filling in for now. Man, it serves that dick right. <laughs> what a great feeling. I think they might even go far in the meet. Hmm. Well, uh, we can't lose either. <laughs> Hell yeah! Oh crap, the ramen's gonna get soggy. Let's eat! Woo! <laughs> that was awesome. Gotta say, top tier slurping sound effects. To tell the truth, I was scared of facing those guys straight up. I, I couldn't stand how much they hated me. It only just made me think of how stupid I was. Most of all, it made me remember how I lost my place with him. Hey, this ain't like me, but I managed to change because you were here helping me. I got you all wrapped up in this shit, but you stayed with me till the bitter end. You didn't abandon me. So, thanks, man. You're welcome. <laughs> It's funny, huh? This started out as us training for the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> How'd it end up like this? Either way, it's my turn now. If anything comes up, you tell me. I'll help you with whatever you need. Good. We have a- I feel a strong bond with Ryuji. Oh, we're zooming in. It's getting real. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood I'm oath. telling you, PR-wise, just Thy change the name from Blood Oath. The wings of rebellion People will be a lot less freaked out. Heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the chariot, granting thee infinite power. Okay. I'm just thinking, what, what is his persona going to turn into? Because, I mean, currently it's a pirate, so... I don't know. Maybe it's like Blackbeard or something? All right. All fusion right. unlocked. You can now fuse Chi Yu, um, the most powerful persona of the Chariot Arcana. Oh. Captain, what well, looks like Captain Kid's evolving into. Um. My new power! What? Um... I'm, I'm just trying to process one bit at a time, okay? So he's on a cloud with an eye on it. Maybe it's a dragon? But if it's a dragon, it's like a really fat one. Uh, he's got a, some kind of bat with nails in it. The huge horn, the collar, the weird chains? Um Yeah, okay. Alright. Ryuji's persona, Captain Kid, has transformed into Satan Taise. What? Alright! Now I have that off my chest. Let's do this! Ryuji, what's wrong with your head? Or more specifically, what's wrong with what's inside of it? First up, the Phantom Thieves. I'll be counting on you, leader, and you can count on me too. What? Hey, now that we're all fueled up, want to race to the station? I'm, I'm still like processing the image I just saw. All right then. So it's got an ability is may increase allies' physical attacks by 40. That's pretty good. Uh, so evade wind. It's really good, and it feels like we should have it. I just need to figure out what we're getting rid of. I mean, I hate it. I think we get rid of Elect Break. It's gonna run into the same issue. Like, if we run into that Break issue, that, that would cause us huge problems, but the rest of them are good. That's the problem I have here. We can't see anything else about it until we uh, come back in. Oh, we should also check its stats comparatively, so we can see how what ah, it's good at. You're back. Okay, 
let's do some comparative stat checking. So, Ryuji. Uh, not party. I just want to have a look here. So, he's got 50 strength, 49 endurance. His strength, his strength is currently boosted, so I reckon it's endurance. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's endurance. By far. Like, he has more than any of ours, I think, as well. He is a very healthy person. I can't remember what- is it this that gives him the strength, maybe? It's something like that. Anyway, he is insanely, um, yeah, he has a ton of health. Also, what's his strength like? Yeah, the only person who has more is, uh, Yusuke. Okay, Yusuke's actually not as much of a strength lord as we first thought when we saw him. Although Ryuji does have a much larger bonus to strength. Um, but yeah, he's he's actually only slightly above. What he get he gains over uh, Ryuji though is that his magic is actually at a reasonable level. So interesting. Uh, anyway, back over to this guy. A title Sun Wukong had given himself. Now I have heard of that one. Ah, so it's, yes, now I see the monkey. Yeah, okay, now it's starting to make more sense. Okay. Born from a rock, he wreaked havoc and was punished by Buddha, who imprisoned him under a mountain. Eventually, he was saved by a monk named uh, Zon... What's that be? Zhuan Zhang? Something like that? Okay. That is... Yeah. Oh, and does that say... Is it, it's like Ook? Or is it... It's something like that, right? Oh, I get it. Now, now I see what's written on there. It's all coming together now. Yep. Okay. Cool. You know, I like it a lot more having actually any idea what I'm looking at. A fierce battle begins as the date of the house... Yeah, we've done this one. Okay. It looks like a different picture. Um, right. There's something I'd like to tell you. Something unbelievable happened. I'm still confused about it. Will you be able to make some time for me today? Ah, so we, yeah, we solved her mother. Uh, decide later. Let's see who else we got available. Kawakami's an up, so Kawakami takes priority, unfortunately. Uh, well, not unfortunately. Well, it is a little unfortunate because we have to see Kawakami, but uh, because I wanted to see the next rest of Hifumi's one, but Kawakami takes huge priority because it gives us extra time, which is something that we don't get otherwise. Yeah, we get that in three ranks. And we're likely going to get a, mem a Mementos trigger next rank. Yeah, which would be good to go into Mementos. We could go into Mementos tomorrow to get that trigger done. Because that would get Futaba and her. That would only leave... Um, it's only going to leave one at that point, right? And one that we know we can't finish. Yeah, it would only leave the skilled gamer. And we know we can't finish the skilled gamer. Uh, because we don't have enough days. Yeah. Yeah, this is fine. So I think what I wanted... Well, Ma Haru might also have one. Yeah, maybe we should spend some time with Haru. But either way, I want to go and spend time with... Um, with Kawakami today, which means we're going to head to Shinjuku. I'm just thinking... I might put points into making An's one next, so that we can get to the level 10 with her as well. Because I think getting to level 10 is actually something that I want to do now. What shall we do? Just because I'm not sure how much time we have after these 22 days, I want to be sure that we have our um, party up to the highest level they can get to. So Haru and An are really high priority. Haru, An, and Kawakami. They're, they're, they're our top priorities. Futaba as well, to a lesser degree, but she doesn't actually fight too often, so... But yeah. Anyway, that's good. We got On to the next think? level. Right. Uh, we have Temperance, I think, which is hers, I think. Do we have Temperance? Let's have a quick, uh... Temperance, then she is... Kawakami... Temperance, perfect. Let's go! Oh. It's almost worth checking so we don't have to go back and do all Hi. of this again. Hi, I'm all yours, Master. Oh, it's you. Everyone thinks you're back in your hometown already, so be careful, okay? I'll cover as... Uh, I'll come over as long as you request me. Uh, does your room need cleaning, or did you need me to cook for you? I provide all sorts of services, but um, there's stuff I need to talk to you about, so would you request me? Does it still cost me 5,000 uh, yen? Hey. Well, I guess so. That's fine. I'll head over right now! Alright then. Hey, hey! I actually really like the antique feel of this room. Hmm. 
But I have to say goodbye to it today. Um... The thing is, I've decided to quit. My boss found me a part-time job that pays better than this one. Oh. Yeah, no, no, no. We can't let that happen. You may be an awful teacher. You should be fired, and you shouldn't be working anywhere close to um, young children. However, at the same time, we can't let you do this, so we'll, 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 we'll solve your problems. Takasi kuns guardians keep increasing their demands, so this is just what I have to do. That's the wrong decision. Uh. Then what's the right decision? Please tell me. Just stop paying them. Takase kun's guardians say the only true way to apologize to Takase kun is by paying them. Yeah, they would do. Just don't pay them. Call their bluff. If that's not true, then what's the right thing to do here? I wonder if I can escape all this if I quit being a teacher. People like me have no right being a teacher. If I quit my own, I won't have to pay them. I mean, the, the, the first part of your sentence of like, you know, this little paragraph isn't untrue. I mean, you shouldn't be a teacher, but at the same time, you know, we want to fix your issues. That's why I'm gonna, uh, going to quit both my teaching job and my maid job. What do you think? Uh, you know what? The one that, I think that the one that she wants is this one. I need my teacher. Huh. You always seem to make things about you. Never mind. If only I could follow my own path like you do. Now that I think about it, it's too late for me to stop being a teacher. If I really felt bad for what happened, I would have resigned the day he died. And yet, I still feel the need to teach. I wonder why I feel that way even now. Hmm. Well, that's your answer. Zaplacoon. Hmm. Oh, that's right. I decided uh, the way to apologize to him was to make sure there wouldn't, uh, there won't ever be another student like him. Because I might have been able to save him if I hadn't been afraid of rumors or labels back then. I wanted to become a teacher who takes care of her students. That's the mindset I had. But now I spend all my free time at part-time jobs just so I can continue working as a teacher. I put the critical work of a teacher on the back burner so I can make apology money. That's where it all went wrong. I can't make things right with uh, with Takasi Kun like this. Hmm. Mistakes can be fixed. I'll be the teacher I aspire to be. That's the right way for me to make amends to Takasi Kun. From here on, I refuse to pay them any more money. That is my answer. Well, what do you think? That that that's the right choice. You're right. You can't get the right answer from someone else. You, it can only be found from within. I mean, you literally can. We told you that, like, last time we talked. I learned that from you. No, no, okay, sure. In a way, you're my teacher. Haha, <laughs> just kidding, unless... I feel Kawakami's trust in me is strengthening. I, I don't really understand her, All but right. that's okay. The number went up. I've been so worried about making money that I haven't been paying attention to my students, especially to you. I averted my eyes from you because I, you were labeled just like Takasi-kun was. But from now on, I'm going to protect you too. As your teacher, I will never betray you. Um, that's reassuring. Leave it to me. I can be decisive when it counts. I'll speak with the Takasis. I'm not going to run anymore. Everything should be fine as long as I talk to them face to face. Alright, time for me to go. Thanks. Thank you, see you later. Oh yeah. Good yeah. night. The next one is 100% a mementos visit. Because it's going to be her going, those things went badly. Oh, is this Master? Thank you so much for today. Oh wait, I was supposed to stop uh, working as Becky by today. To be honest, I always kind of knew in my heart I couldn't go on like this forever. But I felt so stuck facing it alone, it's thanks to you I actually figured out what I need to do. Hmm. Well. Sure. I'll do anything for you. Come on, you realize you can't feed me lines like that anymore. 
but I haven't given you any proper appreciation yet, so thank you, really. Get to bed early tonight, lack of sleep is basically poison for your body and mind, okay? Good night. Alright. Alright. <laughs> well, we got some points at the end there. The back half went well. Right. Time to check our IMs. Ooh. What are your plans for today? Okay, so we can go get a rank 10 with her. Haru's asking, are we going to the palace? The answer is no. Okay, let's head downstairs. Who have we got? No, leave. Leave. Yep, see ya. It's the home shopping! What have we got? We got the Yaki Emo set. Okay. Uh, delete the... Eat the delicious Emo and power up your stamina. Okay. And then, the special sweet set. Which is... Hey, Moondango. Oh, I have to. I have to. Hey, hey. Give me the Moondango. 100% Moondango. Right. And Whoa. we're through here. Hello. Nope, same stuff. Okay, so. Futaba locked by Mementos. An isn't up. Makoto is maxed. Nobody is here. Nobody is here. Okay. Well, uh, let's go spend time with Ahn. Uh, she's max level, so there's actually, I was going to say, there's no point in checking her confidant, because, well, she's max level. So we can just go speak with her. Uh, let me double check it's a level up. I think it is, and I'm almost certain it is, yeah. Cool. Right. Hello. We have to make them pay. That evil man is the root of all the evil we've been fighting against. We need to steal his heart. So what's the plan for today? Let's hang out. Um, are you sure that's going to be okay? Shouldn't we forget where the treasure is first? We have plenty of time. <sighs> this can't be happening. Uh, I guess there's not, not much point in worrying if you're so sure. Are you free today? Uh, yeah. Let's go. Thanks. I have a magazine shoot today. It's a special of me and Mika, up close and personal with two popular models. I won't need to be there for it. It's over at Seaside Park. Let's go. Have I ever been to Seaside Park? I don't think I have. Oh, I have never been here. And don't pull a stunt like that again, okay? Uh, okay, I won't. Hmm? What's going on here? Oh, uh... Oh, right, you fell victim to, to it too. Is it okay if I tell her, Mika-chan? Yeah. Do you remember a while back when a bunch of models weren't showing up to our shoots? Oh yeah, I remember. Well, apparently Mika-chan was posing as our agency and telling them the shoot locations changed. Oh. We heard rumors that she might have been doing it, but we thought people were just jealous of her. I mean, those shoots she filled in for really boosted her popularity. Anyway, I asked her about it today, and all she had to say was, I'm sorry. What I did was really terrible. I caused so much trouble for everyone. But I'm going to start working even harder from now on. I promise. Seems like you should just be fired. Ugh. Anyway, let's get started. You're ready to go, right? Well, I guess her popularity's still high, so she's still got value to them. Yep. So effectively, she got no punishment for what she did. Alright, seems fair. You really did something that lame? What are you calling lame? This industry is overflowing with models. Without an in, your career will never even get off the ground. Chances don't come to those who wait. You have to make your own luck if you want to succeed. <sighs> you really are something. It's your own fault for getting the boot. If you can't crawl your way back up, you may as well go home. Either way, it's not like I'm not talented. I just needed my shot, and now I'm selling like crazy. You talk big, but they still found out about your fake emails. Sure, but all I had to do was offer a teensy apology. It would have been dumb to try and hide it from them. Anyway, they can't sack me now. I'm going to get even more popular, even if it means being detested for my actions. <laughs> oh. You're just like the villains I used to admire when I was a kid. Beautiful, strong, and wicked. Honestly, I can't bring myself to hate you. Well, I don't have any trouble hating you. 
Sorry, Mika, but your hard work is only going to get you second place. I'm going to be the number one model. You might be more popular right now, but I'll take that spot from you fair and square. Huh. Alright then, I won't pull any more tricks. I'll beat you with beauty, fair and square. Of course! Sounds good to me. The photo shoot started. Anne and Mika are both beaming at the camera. Yeah, that's it! This way! Isn't that Mika? Wow, she's even prettier in person. It's Mika! Oh, and Ahn too! They're both so cute! Oh, they must... Uh, what they must have to eat to have their bodies like that. The world is so unfair. They might have some natural beauty, but they gotta be exercising to have those bods. Wow, what a pose. Give me a few more, just like that. Something's changed in Anchan, huh? Yeah, she's really amped up the sexiness. Maybe she's gained some confidence. Alright, uh, let's take five here. Go get changed, Mika-chan. Oh, but not on. <laughs> Man, this is so fun. Today's been really great so far. So, how was I? Um, everyone was complimenting you. Yes! Really? That's awesome. It's kind of hard for me to tell, but I guess I've changed, huh? Um. I know I said I just want to be the number one model, but I'm okay with that not happening just yet. For now, I just want to keep improving, one step at a time. Then someday down the line, I'll be able to look at myself with pride. Hopefully people will see that confidence and draw strength from it. I'm going to be a ray of light for the people on the, of this planet. Aren't you taking it a little bit seriously? You're just like having your photo taken for some magazines. I mean, I get why you're doing it, but like the beacon of hope for people of this planet, I mean, it seems a little uh, extreme, you know? Just like you and Shiho are for me. You can do it, on. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Thanks. Alpax, you're my light. Alright, break's over. Anchan, you're gonna be the main focus for this session. Got it. Hey! Hey, let's hang out a little more once the shoot ends, okay? Where are we going? The diner? Yup. Ooh, what have we got to eat? So we got so like some green bits, some kind of salad. We got meat with sauce on it, and then what, scrambled eggs or something like that? I'm trying to figure out what the yellow, it could be like potato or something, but I think it, it looks like eggs. Okay. Ahn seems to be thinking about something. Ah, that's, those are, that's the gears grinding that I hear. Back when I met Shiho, when she saved me, Oh yeah, so rank 10 and she wasn't voice acted. Oh, okay. Maybe it's different for her because her ending could change depending on whether or not you were dating her. I realized that personal relationships are something to be treasured. That's why I'm not going to run away anymore. I'll face myself head on. This time, it's my turn to help someone. But... I'm still kind of worried. Do you think you could help me? Ask me anything. Mm-hmm. You can lean on me too, if you need it. I already am. <laughs> I feel like we finally see each other eye to eye. I'm so glad I met you. I feel a strong bond between me and Ahn. Alright. I'm ready to I see what thou. hers looks like. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of the lovers, granting thee infinite power. I don't know where, why in my mind I was trying to find something to replace the words of Blood Oath. I was like, maybe there's a joke in there. And I was going, hmm, what about like a blood bunny or something? And I realized in my head, the problem isn't the word oath, is it? <laughs> a blood anything else is still going to seem pretty sinister. All right. 
All right. You can now fuse Ishtar, the most powerful persona of the Lover's Arcana. All right. It could look like anything. Uh, or, okay. I can sense a new power growing within me. I'm, I'm taking it in. So, six eyes, spider, spider lady, spider lady with chain dog heads. I can't come up with what I think this is. Maybe it's the vampire because of the cape. I have no idea what this is. All right. Um, Anne's persona, Carmen, has transformed into a uh, Hecate or Hecate. I think that this one is a Greek god. Which would make sense, or goddess, I guess, due to the chains. That doesn't mean I'm gonna stop counting on you. After all, you're an eternal member of my fan club. I don't know why I thought the chains made it more Greek, but it's the name, of, I think I recognize the name. That's where my mind was going. I was saying like the chains and the dogs, maybe there's something else in Greek stuff. Like maybe she carries them around somewhere. I don't know. Anyway, we'll find out in a second. Eternal? It means forever. Got it? Yeah, I know that. Anyway, let's eat before our food gets cold. Time to dig in. Yes, could you explain what it is? Oh, never mind. So, evade ice. Uh, may decrease SP cost of allies' magic skills. Okay. Um, so what do we get rid of for her? I mean, I hate to say it, right? It's fire break. Yeah. I do hate to say it, but like it's the most obvious one to get rid of. Ah, you're back. Okay, let's have a look at her new confidant. So, on is now maxed. So, uh wait, that's the wrong way to go. Uh I actually went into the wrong menu. Uh into stats on. There we go. A Greek goddess of crossroads, ghosts, and witchcraft. She is commonly attended to by dogs. Oh, these are just dogs. That's fine. Uh, she is also known to be the chief of the witches that appear in the play Macbeth. Ah, bubble, bubble, toil, and trouble. Right, okay. I'm trying to see what else she's got here. So her magic stat is insane, right? That's her thing. Yeah, so her magic stat is, like, out of this world good. Because, I mean, ours is the only one that's even close, and ours is a higher level than hers. Yeah. So, she's basically hit them with your magic spell. But actually, her other stats aren't nearly as bad. She doesn't have, like, a dump stat. Like, for instance, if we go to Ryuji, his magic is just terrible. If we go to An, most of her other stats are kind of just even. She's kind of average apart from the magic. But the magic is really good. Anyway, there we go. Um, yep, yeah, that's still the same thing. Let's have a look at these. So, Jahai is asking what her availability is. Definitely want to see her. Why we can max out as well if we want to. I think, because I think that he's level 9. Uh, he is not level 9. He's level 8. Okay. Oh, what's Chihaya? She's level 8 as well. Uh, I should probably just check all of these in one go. Fortune Teller level 8. Yeah. Okay. So, Awai, Chihaya. Neither one can be upgraded. Which one am I closer to? Now, that is a difficult question. Hmm. What, what, what? So, I know we get his stuff for free if we go and see him, which is kind of pointless. What do we get if we go and see her? What's her max rank? Special bond reading. Clearly understand what other people are thinking. Maybe it allows us to like get a cheat when we're doing the conversations. I don't know if I need that, but I don't know. Maybe we'll try and boost her thing for herself and then see what else we got. Yeah, okay. Hello. Um... Yes, uh, I would like to get a fortune reading. I Also, I should go to uh, Kichijoji uh, and see whether we can get the thing from the like, creepy guy, because I believe we already got whatever he was after. Yes, uh, have fortune read. 
I would like to know how I can get closer to you. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see. So. Uh, we can deepen our friendship. Nice. What do you think? I should probably head over there anyway. I'll, I'll pay the, uh, like, whatever amount it is. Something like 400, right? Yeah, 400 there and back. Roughly. Okay. So through here. Sharp left. And... Hello. Rumor has it there's a particular snack that's taking the foodie world by storm. Your target this time is the legendary Yaki Emo. Supposedly it's only sold at a sweet potato stand in a certain town. Empowering uh, Fuda is what he offers us. I actually haven't already got the thing. We know where the thing is sold because we've been there before. That's what we have. Yeah, so he's not there yet. Okay, so we should check that each day. Right, back over here. Uh, I don't know if we have a fortune one, but we'll double check. Uh, no fortune persona. Let's jump in and see whether we can get one. Hey, inmate. So, once we're in here... Hello. Yes, yes, oh. yes. Uh, I would like um, to fuse a search. fortune. I cannot fuse a fortune, or at least not a new fortune. Can I network well, fuse a fortune? I don't oh, know. I'm gonna fuse. Uh, Seth. I cannot fuse Seth. It, oh no, I can. But it's a it's a uh, Picaro, which is not one that we want to keep around. But I suppose I could do this. Looks pretty tough. We haven't got one yet. Okay. I mean, Seth's kind of done because the stats are really bad. So yeah, let's let's switch it up. You wish for more power. It's too powerful for handle. one of my current level. How much are you asking? Yeah, I'll do it. That's fine. Uh, so let's see what we like got. So we're never gonna use this one, but we might as well pass along some things in case we use it for um, yeah, use it for crafting. Crafting's not quite the right word, but you get what I'm meaning. High counter, I think's fine. Uh, it's a it's a normal game one. That's quite useful. Uh, hmm. It Let's just pass it along some generally deal. useful things. <laughs> I see. See how this goes. At the very least, this gets us a new persona. Ha 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 ha! I'm a mysterious Pico. So the trickster wants me to be his mask. Sounds good to me. I'll destroy any who cross you. I don't know if I don't think that these ones count towards completion because they're DLC personas. But all right, what's that one? Uh, Masukaja automatically. Uh, fire ramp is better than one of these. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of this one because I don't want to pass it along because I think it's too strong. Uh, we'll get rid of that one. Cool. It acquired a special skill. Almighty boost. Ooh. Yeah, we'll get that. That's actually really good. If we can pass that along. Uh, let's just have a quick look at it as well. So. Uh, Persona turned to Picaro after becoming the trickster's mask. Son of... Um... Fasife. He was born a bull-headed monster. Locked away in the labyrinth as the Minotaur... He wielded a double-sided axe. Well, yeah, isn't it only called Minotaur Finished because, you know, already? it was in what? Minus? So, like, is that the right term for it? Yeah, I think that was the right one. So, like, no slacking off. surely it's not a Minotaur. It'll be like a whatever tour. Hmm? Minus was the king, though, wasn't he? So it would be like a uh, whatever the king a tour is. Like, whatever his father was or something? I don't know. Anyway, whatever. Um... It, it, it's, it's a pointless thing. Let's, let's do a verification thing. So I've made some more progress with the ADP case. Sit down so I can tell you all about it. Yeah, let's go. Yes. The thing is... So I got all the members of the um, ADP together and gave them a big group apology. They didn't really believe that uh, what I was saying at first, but the truth of the matter settled in eventually. It's just. However, it seems like the members from the executive class are still brainwashed. I'm in talks with a lawyer right now, though. We're gonna get 
We're going to get refunds and outpatient care for all of them. I'm going to give them back all the money I made from selling holy stones too. At least that's what I can do to atone for the... Uh, that's the least I can do to atone for the ignorance I showed back then. That's why I want you to accept this, Zaplasan. A 100,000 yen, a 100,000 yen, a 100,000 yen. Think of it not only as an apology, but as a sign of gratitude for helping me see the truth. A 100,000 yen. Oh yeah. That's what I wanted. My money back. Now can I get interest? Maiden, I'm so happy to see you. What? Your cad, your uh, your Koda san. What are you all doing here? That apology you gave us was all made up, wasn't it? Somebody had to force you to say that stuff. I mean, the chairman was obviously framed. Tell us the truth, please. No. Uh, none um, of it was made up. Um. As for the chairman, I need you to listen to me. Everything he told you in those seminars was a lie. The promises of a great future, the power of the holy stones, the need for donations, all lies. Doesn't it seem strange that he kept asking members for money even through times of financial stress? And beyond that, you guys should have known better than anyone where those donations were ending up. Mm. Even I knew how horrible the ADP scheme was. That's why I had to come forward. No, that can't, that can't be true. You, you're the one who did this to our beautiful maiden. Listen to what Jehaya is saying. Shut your mouth. Please, stop this. He has nothing to do with your situation. I'm the one who sold you those rocks. If you're going to get upset with anyone, it should be with me. But, Maiden, this can't be happening. No, we must continue to place our trust in her. Please, Maiden, cleanse us of our misery. If you leave us now, we'll be fated to drown in sorrow. Look, the only way you can change that is with your own convictions. Neither I nor one of those worthless stones will be able to help you. Uh, but then, how are we supposed to avoid our fated misery? No, a curse is upon us. Maiden, please. <sighs> oh, will you shut your traps? You all need to simmer down and listen to what I have to say for once. Whether you're going to be miserable or not, it's all on your own d damn shoulders. You don't need some divine power mumbo jumbo to be changing your fate. Y'all got that strength in yourselves. Fortune telling can't hold a candle to honest to good willpower. And heck, even if things were bad now, it'll all be fine as long as you keep your heads up. Oh, um... oh, oh, I'm sorry about that. All the stress caused me to lapse into my country dialect. But I stand by what I said. Nothing will, ev will change, will ever change, if all you do is rely on others. Take me, for example. I thought I was destined to live as a monster, but I had the strength to reverse that fate. If you want to control your future, that's all you need. Strength. And the only way forward is through the fortitude of your own heart. My heart? It might not be the easiest thing to accomplish at first. After all, your willpower has been constantly suppressed by those seminars and donations. I'm partially to blame for that. I'm here with you. But that's why I need to show you the light now and help you push on. Maiden. No, I'm not your maiden anymore. I'm just Chahaya Mifuni. Uh, the fortune teller who guides fate. <sighs> I wonder if Yokoda-san and the others will be okay. You, I know how they feel though. They want to cling onto the holy stones just as I clung onto my role as the maiden. If all any of us ever wanted was to be happy, to avoid our fates. Hmm. Well, fate can be changed. Right, I did it, so I'm sure Yokoda-san and the others will be able to too. No matter how many times I have to try, I'll be, I will talk to them until they understand. And when they realize the difficult truth, I'll be there to help them recover. Back in my village, people called me a monster. Here, they revered me as the maiden. Even now, my heart continues to wander. Yet, you somehow saw the real me. <laughs> not just the maiden. Not the maiden. Not a monster. Just Chihaya. Zaplasan. Thank you. I can sense a deep bond of trust from Chihaya. And that's it. Just a bond of trust, nothing more. Do you hear that, Chahaya? All right. This is where, this is the line. <laughs> By the way, Zaplasan, has anyone told you you're a bit nosy? I mean, normally someone wouldn't think to involve themselves in such a strenuous ordeal. Um. So, so, um, there's actually something I've been wondering for a while now. Is fortune telling the only reason you come to see me? 
It's not, is it? Uh, uh, yeah, it is. I'm already in a relationship with another girl. But, hear me out, Jahia's psychic. So she could see the awkward sitcom uh, situations coming up where, you know, we've got one in the uh, apartment, but there's another one at the door. She could see that coming and could just avoid it. But, you know, on the other hand, um, Zaplasan, why'd you come here? I like having my fortune read. Oh, oh I see. Uh, sorry, I was just feeling a bit self-conscious. But... But there's nothing better than knowing my readings help others. Please, come have your fortune read as often as you'd like. After all, we'll be forever joined in our quest to oppose fate. Well then. Anyway, I should be going. I just realized next time. something here. She gave us 100,000 yen, right? We paid her more than 100,000 yen in 5,000 yen in increments. She just gave us our own money back. But she still has a ton of our own money. Like she has a ton of our money anyway. I suppose she did provide a service for the rest of it, but still. Seems a little cheap. I mean, it wasn't cheap, but you get what I'm meaning. Oh, it's me. Sorry for calling so soon. I know we just saw each other. There's something I really wanted to tell you. You're the reason I managed to talk to Yokoda-san and everyone. I plan on doing all I can to support everyone at the ADP for a while. If you're in any trouble, please feel free to uh, stop by for a consultation anytime. Well, um, <laughs> I can say I want one of those stones. No, I'll just say I'm planning on it. Great. Please, I want to help you carve a path to your future as Jahaya Mifumi. Um, fortune teller and emissary of fate. Whoops, I guess I sounded a little too full of myself just then. Maybe I'm not a monster or a maiden, I'm just Jahaya. So if you're ever in trouble, remember you can always come to me, okay? Well, good night and sweet dreams. I just realized that line about going to the future makes a lot of sense if we were still in the past recollection stage of the game. Hmm, interesting. I saw another campaign car. All the news ever talks about is the election. It's weird for it to be given this much attention. Well, we might be getting a new administration, so... When are the polls again? Is it still a ways off? Yeah, yeah, we're not even in the same month of the polls. We got plenty of time. Unlimited time. Hey. 20 days left. We really don't have time to relax, you know? We have plenty of time. Unlimited time. Let's see. There seems to be less fuel. <laughs> okay. I still don't know what to do with that. We asked people for their thoughts on the House of Representatives election. They were asked which politician they thought had the most promise. My, the name we heard most often was Maya Yoshishido, the leader of the United Future Party. It's just one more piece of evidence solidifying Mr. Shido as the front runner in this race. Now then. Just you wait, we'll knock you off your high horse soon. Hello. I wonder if Shido-san will come around here again. I want to hear another of his speeches. He is a very eloquent man and it's very impressive to hear him live. He's got a lot of promise. I always thought politicians couldn't be trusted, but I think he's someone worth voting for leave. Right. Hello. Alright, let's have a little look here. So Haru is available today? Maybe? Ooh. Okay. Okay. Who have we got? So Takami, locked. Yusuke, locked. Haru, available and has an up. Fantastic. Uh, nobody else is available. Well, this seems like an obvious Haru situation. Uh, which one were we seeing Haru with? It'll be the one that I just destroyed. Like, 100% will be the one that I just destroyed. Empress. No, we have it. Fantastic. Right. Uh, I want to head here. I want to go to the school gate. Oh, we could also play the lottery, but I'm not overly worried about that. Uh, actually, let's head back. There is somewhere else I want to check. Uh, I guess we could go to the lottery now that we're not going directly there. Let's head here and see whether the illegal potatoes are here. Yeah, hello. Hello. Oh, I love the way he just said that. Hello. Hello. Y'all, yeah, this is your other potato. See ya. 
Right, uh, I guess we'll head up here next. Do the promenade. Sharp left turn. Into the guy. Hello. Mmm, the delicious aroma of roasted sweet potato. Ah, uh, could you be holding the legendary Yaki Emo in your hands? Uh, you trade it for this empowering Fuda now, wouldn't you? Yeah, let's trade. Sure. See you later. I've never smelled anything as mouth-watering as this. You can only imagine how sweet it must taste. Thank you so much, my client will be ecstatic as well. Look forward to our next trade. Alright. Uh, let's go here. Uh, oh, wait, nope. Yep, I decided I was going to go somewhere else first. Wait, which, where is it? Uh, Station Square is the top one. Of course. Right. Hello. Oh, right. There, there is no, like, daily thing there. I guess maybe we could have done a daily thing earlier? Interesting. I don't know when we can do it. Okay, let's head to the rooftop. Maybe it's, like, a certain day that you can go there and get the scratch card? I don't know. Anyway. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Good day. Uh, I want to see the vegetables. <laughs> uh, they'll be done in a day. Okay. Uh, I thought we'd done more days, but it has been a while since we talked to her. But I suppose we've just done a lot of like high-level stuff that takes a while. Anyway, let's hang out. Okay. Also, I noticed that we can, um, yeah, we can get everyone to gather with her as well. So maybe you can just get anyone to gather with somebody who's available on the day. Uh, anyway, let's hang out with her. Thank you. Or maybe it's Ryuji at weekends. Her during the middle of the uh, week. That's possible. How about a how about Jimbocho? Be the perfect place to live. Well, let's get going. Mm. I see. Mm. So there are eight different ways to roast coffee beans. Apparently, the light roast is the most acidic. It says here the type of roast you want should differ depending on how you want to drink your coffee. Hmm. Could you make some for me? <laughs> I'd rather not. I don't think I could ever hope to match the intense depth of Sakura-san's coffee. You know, Okumura Foods didn't start out as a burger chain. Originally, it was nothing more than a small cafe run by my grandfather. That particular shop closed before I was old enough to appreciate the finer intricacies of coffee. But that's where the real origin of our family business lies. Hmm. Well, that's a surprise. Yes, after all, everyone knows the company is uh, for its burgers. Um... At any rate, after my grandfather passed, the company shut the cafe down due to its steady loss of revenue. He never cared about turning a profit though. His only goal was to make people happy. He built a strong community around the cafe. He'd even give out free meals to those who couldn't afford it. Then the day it closed, people lined up for blocks to give flowers. They really loved that place. But... I wonder how many people would line up for Big Bang Burger if it suddenly went out of business. Depends how much Szechuan sauce it had, really. I know we need to do well to keep our employees paid, but I can't help but think we've lost something important. I mean, Takura, Takakura-san only uh, seems only to be focused on profits. At this rate, we'll never lose our black image. Hmm. Uh, like coffee? Huh? Oh, I get it. <laughs> You're so funny, Alpaxkin. I was worried there that it just didn't hit the mark, and I, I just had my soul crushed. But it's it's like it's it's a little bit uncreased and unfurled now. You were trying to cheer me up, weren't you? Thanks for that. Uh, I think what I really need is to get stronger. I mean, I can act tough in front of my employees, but you know how weak I am inside. And I have a plan, though. Before I can really determine who I trust, I first need to know what it means to have others trust in me. So I'm going to get stronger, strong enough for you and the others to rely on me. I can sense a strong resolve from Haru. Ooh. Okay, so we get Harrison recovery. All right. Which is very good. Hmm. Hmm. But how am I supposed to gain the trust of my employees? I'm not great at public speaking. And even just giving my opinion makes me feel a little nervous. Haru? Huh? Uh, 
Sugimura-san, what are you doing here? I was just heading home from a business engagement when I saw you from my car window. Hmm, do I know you from somewhere? Oh, you're one of those brats from before. Um. Uh, this is a friend from school. He's helping me look for some books today. Anyway, we should be getting back to our shopping. Please excuse us. Hold on, Haru. You think you can go on a date with another man and leave your fiancé in the dust? You are not my fiancé. I already said I'm not going to marry you. Oh yeah? What about the contract I made with your father? <laughs> father is no longer here. Besides, marriage is something you go into with your own free will. A contract could never hold the same weight. Are you sure about that? Think about the reparations clause. If you back out the deal now, you will lose everything you own. Okumura Foods, your estate. Even so, I... And what about your employees? Are you really willing to put their jobs on the line just for the sake of your selfishness? Seems very... What kind of contract could have a marry him or you lose the entire company? And why would anyone sign that? That's just a ridiculous contract to have signed in the first place. And it was her father who signed it and he's dead. I'm fairly certain that that doesn't hold her bound. Anyway. Besides, this marriage is exactly what Okumura Foods needs right now. My father would have no trouble managing your shares or sweeping away your company's tarnished image. <sighs> that reminds me, did Takakura-san tell you about the wedding hall? He got us the Phoenix Wing at the Wilton. Huh? What? He made a provisional reservation for 10 days this coming spring. After all, the sooner the, be the better. Wait a minute. Oh, we'll have to look into our guest schedules as well. There'll be over 300 of them, you know. Takakura-san can handle Okumura Foods in the meantime. Why don't you go stop by the gym or something, Haru? I mean, if you have time to mess around with this punk, you damn well have time to get a little thinner. I'm out of here. Wow! What an awful person. I'm sorry about that. That guy is horrible. Um. You're not wrong about that. He has everything. Fame, intelligence, etiquette. The only thing he needs now is a wife he can control. I guess I'm the perfect target. He's going to get Okuma Foods as well as my entire inheritance. I'm totally powerless against him. You're not powerless. Oh, sorry. I practically forced you to say that. But thank you. Um. Anyway, um, I hope I can share this uh, with you again some other time. For today, though, I'm rather tired. Would it be okay if we parted here? Goodbye. Bye, Haru. Oh, I'm sorry for the sudden call again. The thing is, Sugimura-san reached out to me again after we saw him. I'd rather not talk to him, but I couldn't stand him using the company to threaten me, and even speaking badly of you. The negativity felt so painful, too much uh, to handle alone, and, well, before I knew it, I was already calling you. You can talk to me anytime. Hearing that makes me so happy. Thank you. Even though I just promised myself I'd get stronger, I suppose I'm still depending on you. But still, I can't help but worry about the contract. How frustrating. I, I can't just let them keep manipulating me like a puppet. I have to find some way I can change this. Talking to you has really helped calm me uh, down. Uh, help me calm down. Thank you, really. We'll talk again soon, right? So I'm assuming that we're going to need to chain Sugimura-san's heart, but like... I guess that's the next level. Ah, you're back. Yo. Another box came for you. Guess that was only level hey. six. Level seven mate, is usually one of the ones. Ah, Mundango. Oh. Fantastic. Uh, but yes, it is usually one of the ones at level seven where you get the uh, Mementos lock, I think. And then level eight is the one that you get after that. So what does she get next? Uh, she gets soil improvement. Decreases total amount of time it takes to cultivate vegetables. 
I'm not overly worried about that one. Oh, I was gonna end the episode, but oh, oh I guess not. She's just sitting, she's just like, I'm sitting here playing Shogi whenever you're available. Who else is available? So Sotaro is locked. She's playing Shogi. Oh yeah. So I guess we should put, push Oya up and then maybe go spend time with Fifumi or something. Although Oya's next one is level 10. She's not a member of our party, so it's slightly different. I'm not feeling uh, the same urge to push her up to the max rank. But um, what do we get for max ranking her? Ah, yeah, you better easier to ambush enemies regardless of level. Okay, I don't really care about that. Hmm, I get that she must have a great level, like 10th one, Hifumi, because her level 9 is kind of bad. Right, let's play. Co-opted Celtic Holiday. C-H-R-I-S-T-M-A-S. -S. It's Christmas! Alright. Reward for tricks. Um, I don't know, you know what? Let's, let's type in most of this. I didn't even look at the letters. It was just such a right time of year, you know. It, it just made sense. Uh, where's the M? But it is Christmas, right? Am I crazy? Wait, it's not? I was so certain I was right. But there's no M. Oh, well, you know what? No, keep trying. Just, you know, erase my, uh... Erase my mistake. It's not... That's the, it's the wrong co-opted Celtic holiday. My bad. Traditional magician. Uh... I don't know. What is a traditional magician? A something. If he's traditional, he's a witch. Nope. Nope. Uh, traditional could be a. I was trying to think like trickster or something, but it's too uh, too long. Reward for tricks. Um. I don't know what reward for tricks is. I'm trying to think what this uh, co-opted Celtic holiday is now. Um. Hmm. Like what 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 month is it? Is we're going into December, which is why I was like it must be that, right? Solstice? No, I need more S's. I think. Uh unless it's in Celtic, which is gonna cause us some problems. I gotta say, we do have enough to write the word witch. Like, we, we definitely have enough to write witch here. Alright. Just... Just as a, like... If I typed in the word witch here... What could we fill in the rest with? I don't think this is the right answer, because... That doesn't make a lot of sense. But anyway. Reward for tricks. It's Halloween. It's Halloween. See, once I figured out it was Halloween, this became a lot easier. There we go. Because <laughs> that's treats. And then this is... Halloween. Yup. That makes a lot more sense. You know what? Wrong holiday, but right idea. A holiday held on October 31st with conflicting origin stories, such as a harvest festival for the ancient Celts and the Christian holiday for honouring the saints. The term jack-o'-lantern also has a range of attributed uh, sources, but generally agreed that jack-o'-lantern carving for the spooky holiday originated in Ireland. All right. Makes sense given the name. You know, if I had to guess, jack-o'-lantern, it, it sounds like it's got the right cadence. All right, well, crossword successfully destroyed. Time for us to end the episode here. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.